Thinking of doing your HGV license? Or you've just passed your HGV license? Not sure on driver's hours? Not sure on working time? Not sure how you hitch up to a trailer? Not sure how you strap a load? Then why not check out the new Essential Truckers Handbook? Crack a little book, jam packed with information, lots and lots of information on it. Nice handy size to carry around. I keep it in my shelf up the top there, so if I need it, I'll just refer to it. It's got so much information in it, guys. Uh, link will be in the description. Take a look, check it out, enjoy it. Enjoy the video, guys. A very good morning, all. How the devil is everyone this week? Hope everyone is well. Welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to the vlog. You join me this morning down in Southampton. Uh, it is Tuesday morning. I was going to say Wednesday then, but it's not. It's Tuesday. <laughs> Feels like Wednesday because I ran out on Sunday. Um, oh, bumpy, 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 bumpy. Uh, got an empty box on the back. And now I am going to be going into the dock with a 6 or 7 VPS. That looks like Matt. Um. Get out of here. Yeah, 6 till 7 VBS, it's half past 6 now. Um, finished the quarter past 9 last night, so I've had a 9 off. Uh, started at quarter past 6, did my walk around checks, blah blah blah. And uh, say it's half past 6 now. So I'm heading over to the dock, literally 5 minutes away. Um, uh, I am going to Bedford. I don't know whether I just said that or not. Don't know. Can't remember. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to Bedford today. Um, on a Sunday, um, I came in. Well, I came into work about two o'clock. Um, lots of lights on that. Very pretty. Um, yeah, I came to work for two. Down to the dock. Box off. Box on. Um, and headed up towards Driffield. It wasn't originally my work. I was just, a, normally I was going to come in Sunday, as you know, I last said on my last vlog, I was coming in Sunday. But I was originally just coming down to Southampton and uh, and I'm picking a box up at 5 a.m. Uh, I was coming down and then going to park up and then go into the dock for five. But as it happened, um, I covered a job to go up to Driffield. So, got up as far as uh, Leicester, Sunday night, finished about quarter past 11, and then uh, about nine off, started quarter past eight. Yesterday morning, up to Driffield, got there for 10 past 11. I was there until half past two, and then it was a six hour run back down then last night with, with a break and whatever. And I actually packed up a quarter past nine last night. So. A 13 hour day yesterday. Uh, I've had a quick look at the postcode that I've got for this Bedford one. And. Uh, yeah, it looks like it's going to be another interesting one. Comes up with a very, very small circumference, very small square on the map for the postcode. No businesses there. So, yeah, this could be fun. Just as if it could be fun getting out of here. Matt 
Mark's just messaged me. I'm wondering if he slotted me. I will have a look in a second. Quite warm this morning actually, 16 and a half degrees out there. Bit of a change. The last couple of evenings have been a little bit nippy, but a bit warmer tonight or last night. <sighs> right, let's get in the dock. Let's get this off, get one on, and head up towards Bedford. And I will, uh, I'll probably speak to you either on my way up or just before I get there. One of the two. See you in a bit, guys. Toodles. <laughs> Hello. I'm in empty pack. Matt did slot me. Empty pack to transfer area three. But, <laughs> oh dear. A bit busy near this morning. I haven't seen it this busy for a very long time. Um, I have about 10 trucks in front of me. <laughs> yeah, could be in here a while. Oh uh, well, just so I'd show you the queue in here. <laughs> oh dear, dear, dear. Oh well, never mind, eh? Get there when we get there, innit? <laughs> See you in a bit. Doodles. Hello, me again. Half hour I was in there waiting for my box to be taken off. I've been sat here now for 10 minutes waiting for my box to be put back on. And I just thought to myself now, I promised someone I'd do him a shout out. So, um, Paul and Michelle Johnson, a very, very happy 39th anniversary for this Friday, I do believe. Hope you have a fab day, guys. Uh, I promised Paul I'd give him a shout out for himself and Michelle for their anniversary. So there you go. There's your shout out, guys. Hope you have a fab day. 39 years. You'd have got less for shooting him. Just saying. <laughs> uh, there's with me and me and Claire, two years. Yeah, another 37 to go. I don't think I'll be here in 37 years' time. But there we go. <laughs> Besides the point. Uh, so yeah, huh. happy anniversary guys. Well, watch it don't get splinters there. Uh. Uh, yeah, just waiting on the box now. Uh, it is now 25 to 8. So, let's have a wait and see how long I'm in here for. Oh, dear, 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 dear. There we go. It is busy on you this morning though. It's very busy on you. There's uh, queues everywhere. I'd even queue to get into transfer area three so and there's one two three me four five six six here uh, I'm in the low section of transfer area three and the higher section is absolutely rammed over there as well so there we go anyway just so they come back to you and wish Paul and Michelle a very happy anniversary for Friday I'm hoping this is gonna be out Wednesday so yeah Happy anniversary, guys. See you in a bit. Toodles. Hello, welcome back. Yeah, join me a couple of hours later. Oh my goodness, the weather has turned. It is absolutely dipping it down. All fun and games, though. All fun and games. Um, considering I stopped for fuel as well, I haven't done bad for time. I got caught in a little bit of traffic um, on the M3. That delayed me by about 10 minutes. But I think I've made that back up now. Um, I'm due to get there now for just before 11 o'clock. Uh, I told Matt in the office that I'd be there about 10 past 11, because that's what I said when I was getting fuel. But I've, uh, I've done okay so far. I am now five minutes away. Um, I'm hoping I found the, uh, the correct one. I've got it on Google. It's a different postcode to what I've got, but it's the same area. So Google and the sat-nav look more or less the same at the moment. So hopefully, fingers crossed, I'll find it no problem. 
Um, I'm not 100% sure yet, but there's a possibility that I've got to get back down to Southampton and then have a Cumbran for nine, uh, 7 o'clock tonight. So in which case, if that's the case, I'll have to drop it there and pick it back up in the morning because it takes them two hours to tip it and I've only got till 9 o'clock. So, but plans might change. It depends on how long I'm in here for. And that's the biggest thing is how long I'm, I'm going to be in here for now uh, tipping. Could be half hour, could be three hours, who knows. Don't even know what I've got on the back. Don't know whether it's little boxes that have got to be handballed off or whether it's uh, just uh, like, I don't know, 12 pallets or whatever else. I just I don't, just don't know. Don't know what's on the back. Haven't got a Scooby-Doo. So, just have to wait and see when I get there now. Just been talking to Claire and uh, she's on her way to Thetford. She uh, did a drop and swap in Tesco's this morning in Mega. Uh, Going to be coming off of this one. Make sure my inside is clear. It is. Move over. Um, yeah, she did a drop and swap. Went up to Bridgend. Uh, took an empty up to Bridgend. Uh, swap trailers again for a loaded one, and she's on her way to Thetford for tomorrow. So. Pretty straightforward day for Claire to, today, I gotta be honest. Alright, so I'm going right on this roundabout at the top here. Good to go. Ooh, lane closed. Out. All good. I don't think I've done this one before. I can't remember doing it anyway. I've done a Bedford once before, but I don't think it was this one. Don't remember coming up this way anyway, so... I think it's a different one. I think the last one I did in Bedford was that uh, brand new place. It wasn't even on the map. At least I got this one on Google. So the postcode is slightly different. But looking at the nav and the map on Google, it uh, looks like it's taken me to the same place. Literally 0.8 miles away. So next roundabout, I gotta go right. Hopefully that sign there will now say industrial estate to the right. Fingers crossed. Yes, Wilstead Industrial Park. Looking good. Looking good. This does ring a bell. This does ring a bell, I gotta be honest. There it is. Metro supply chains. That's what I'm going. I think I have been here before. Sure I have. I don't know. I'm getting old. Just about remember what I did yesterday. Um, so I presume now it's gonna be straight over. Logistics Park. It's 
not going to be that turning, so hopefully there's another one just after it. There you go. Is there anyone in the gatehouse, I wonder? Nope. Alright, so I've got to find someone then. Transport office goods in over there. Okay, let's park up over here on the left. I'm gonna get wet! It is dumping it down out there. I've got to double check actually, make sure it is this one I'm going for. I'm sure they said Metro Supply Chains. I'll do. I'm steaming up yeah. But yeah, come on for two minutes. I should clear everything up. Break. There we go. Right, let's double check it is this one that I'm looking for. Yes, it is. Postcode completely wrong. Well, postcode I got on Google was 6EF, and this is the, on the paperwork it says 6EA. So, not a great deal of difference, but it's different. All right, I have to put me waterproof on, I think. Oh. All right, there's my hat over there. Right then, let's get this done. I'll come back to you in a bit. Toodle. Okay. No problem at all. I'm not going to put that out the window because it's absolutely rain, tipping down with rain. But if you can see that, let's put that on there a minute. So you can actually hear me. I'm going to put it onto B5. So we'll uh, do a bit of a spinny, but yeah. My legs are soaking just walking across there. Right, let's put the window down. Uh, have a look now when I open the doors, see what we got. And give me a rough idea then of how long I'm going to be. There's a few of them in there anyway, so hopefully it won't be too long. a little bit so I can open the doors and line up at the same time I'll drop the suspension down as well then all right let's go open the doors that's the front camera switching off it'll be a tick oh. Rain, rain, go away. Come on back another day. All right, let's drop the suspension because I can't reach those handles at the moment.
Almost there. Come on. There we go. Oh, we're gonna reach handles now. Let's have a look, see what the light will open up. Oh, we got yeah. Ah, oh, big boxes. And little boxes. <laughs> Might be here a while. Easy to open. Yeah. But these doors are really tight. Yeah. There we are. Job done. Suspension's down. Put me gloves away. It's wet out there. Ooh, tuck the shoe in. Okay, let's turn you back around. There we are. There we go. Whoop. Almost there. And we're on. Handbrake, neutral. Blew the window up, because I gotta take my keys in. And job done. Right then, let's get this sorted. It is now 11.09 actually. It's a point, I'm gonna say that I'm on site. I'm gonna do that now. <laughs> On site, yes. Sorted. Right then. Let's take the keys in. Get this tipped. See you in a bit. Doodles. Hey guys. I am all tipped. And look at the difference in the weather now. Glorious sunshine again now. I got soaked earlier. <laughs> I'm all done. Um, it is now 25 past one, so just over two hours yet, so it's not too bad. Um, heading straight back to the dock now. Uh, I've just been asked what VBS I want, and I said 16 to 17 should be good. Uh, due to get there at the moment at 3.58, so... Given traffic, uh, you know, hopefully traffic is not too bad, then... Uh, Hopefully, I'll get there for the time stated. Uh, I'm got a clue what I'm doing next yet. Uh, there's nothing on the system as of yet, but that might change in a bit. Might put something up. So I don't know whether I'm supposed to be doing this Combran one or what. Moment. So uh, I got to go back that way, but I couldn't turn right out of there. So I got to go around this roundabout, I presume, and then back out that way. Um, I do need to stop. Um, on the way down at some point because I think I need the toilet in view of the facilities should have asked in there really but never mind I'm sure I've been on this estate before I don't know whether I've been into that B&M's before maybe I think I have I think I've been into that B&M you guys might be able to remind me on that one So that's basically me done and dusted now, really. Um, 
Let's see, back to Southampton. Box off, box on. Um, see what I'm doing from there then. Um, I'm gonna probably cut this one short now. Um, so it'll be a nice little video for Wednesday. I'll get this edited up tonight because it's being Tuesday. I'll edit this up tonight and get it uploaded, ready for tomorrow night. So you'll have another one to watch tomorrow and then uh, I'll record at the end of the week then for Saturday's vlog. And uh, I'll probably be editing that down the caravan because I do believe we are down the van this week, uh, this weekend. So we're going straight down from work, Claire will be going straight down from when she finishes. It's the thing, we've sighted it now, see? We've got more chance of using it now without having to go and collect it and worrying about what time we're finishing and that sort of thing. Uh, well, we haven't got to worry about what time we're... <clears throat> we got to leave sight on the Sunday and all that. Just there. Just go. Sorted. So, yes. Uh, yeah, I believe we're, we're going down the caravan this weekend, straight from work. So, happy days. So, I'll probably edit the Saturday's vlog up um, down there then. So... Don't forget, guys, if you are watching and you're not subscribed, if you've liked what you've seen, then uh, why not contemplate pressing that subscribe button? And then you can uh, press the old bell. No, take your time, mate. Don't worry. You press the old bell notification. Let, uh, let you know when uh, my videos are out. And uh, as I say, stay tuned. Things are changing, hopefully. So, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. Do appreciate it. Whatever you're doing, be safe. Be good, and I'll most definitely catch you in the next one. Toodles. <laughs>